praise God, dear friends. I just want to encourage you with these verses of scripture as we enter the month of August. May this scripture encourage you and take you through the month of August. Numbers chapter 14 verse 7 to 9. The land we pass through, spy out, is an exceedingly good land. If the Lord delights in us, then he will bring us into this land and give it to us. A land which flows with milk and honey. Only do not rebel against the Lord, nor fear the people of the land, for they are our bread. Their protection has departed from them, and the Lord is with us. Do not fear them. So these twelve spies come back from the promised land. Ten of them give an evil report. Ten of them spoke about the giants and the problems in the land that were much great about only Joshua and Caleb. Both of them said that God is able to help them defeat those giants and God is already removed the power of those giants. So my friends, in the month of August or you may be already going through some challenge in your life, maybe a problem that is standing like a giant against you. These problems to you may seem really big. They may seem like you cannot change these problems. You cannot do anything against these problems. You are helpless against these problems. But my friends, let's turn our eyes and look at how Caleb and Joshua looked at how great their God was. They said, God is with us. God is able to defeat them. The power of these giants has been removed from them. That problem that is lingering, that problem that you are encountering, the power of that problem to harm you or overcome you has already been removed, my friends. No matter how big the problem or how big the giant, remember Joshua and Caleb looked at God as much greater than any giant, much greater than any enemy. In the same way, you and I must remember that our God is much bigger than any challenge much bigger than any enemy and when we do not fear and we put our trust in the greatness, the power, the mercy and the wisdom of God, you're going to overcome that challenge, you're going to overcome that giant, you're going to overcome that problem and you and I are going to inherit the promised land, inherit every good and perfect gift that God has in store for you and for me. So my friends, may this month of August be a month where we conquer our enemies, where we conquer our battles and we inherit and receive every good and beautiful thing that God has for you and me and our family members future. Can we, can we dedicate this month of August with a word of prayer? Dear Lord Jesus, we just Bring every listener, Lord, every viewer who is watching this video, Lord. We just believe, Father God, as we have read this beautiful portion of scripture, Lord, Lord Jesus, may this become a reality in their lives, Father God. May they overcome every challenge that stands before them in Jesus' name, Father God. May they be more than conquerors to Christ Jesus who lives in us, Father God, we thank you, Lord. Not only may we overcome the challenges that we see, but help us to inherit and receive and walk in every beautiful, every perfect and every blessed plan that you have for each of us, Father God. In Jesus' name, we pray and we give you all the glory. In Jesus' name, amen. Wish each of you a very blessed month of August. God bless you.